Hi guys, you are watching Trish Kitchen and I am Trisha. First of all, if you are new in my channel, please like and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates. Today I am going to share with you Jeera Aloo's recipe. It's a very easy and quick recipe. This is a no onion, no garlic recipe. You can also add a pinch of hing. Now let's see how to make Jeera Aloo. First of all, let's make the Jeera Aloo's masala. I am using here 1 dry chilli, 1 tablespoon of cumin seed, 1 tablespoon of coriander seed. Dry roast them until they become fragrant and dark brown in color. Remove the pan from heat and let the seeds cool down. Transfer the seeds in a grinder and grind to a make smooth powder. Now peel and cube the potatoes into small cubes. Heat oil in a pan. Add cumin seeds. I am using here 1 tablespoon of cumin seeds. Saute for 30 seconds or until cumin seeds turn slightly red. Now add cubed potatoes. Mix well and allow this to cook for 5 minutes. The potatoes will brown slightly. Add salt and cover with a lid and let this cook for 10 to 15 minutes. Now the potatoes are almost cooked. Add 1 tablespoon of grated ginger and mix well. Now add dry masalas, cumin powder, salt, coriander powder, turmeric, chilli powder, pepper powder, amchur powder and sugar. Mix well. Add few green chilies. It will give a very nice flavor. Now add the dry roasted powder and mix well. You can make this dish with boiled potatoes too. I chose to use uncooked potatoes as I don't like boiled potatoes taste in jeera aloo. Now add 1 tablespoon of ghee. Toss gently and cook for another 10 to 15 minutes without a lid on low to medium heat. This will crisp up the potatoes slightly. Now add chopped coriander leaves. Our jeera aloo is ready to serve now. Serve hot with puri, roti, paratha or with dal and rice. Thanks for watching. If you like my video, please like and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates.